Hola chicos, Harry here from Chat Spanish teaching you useful Spanish things. Lo que. Let's get into it. This one's for you, Brian. As you can see, I do take requests, so make sure you comment on the videos, give them a like, and if you haven't subscribed, please do that before continuing. Que with an accent. Let's just refresh ourselves. This is what. So you're going to see this in a question or you'll see it in an interrogation, an exclamation. That's what I wanted to say. So what or what are you doing later tonight? That's when it has an accent. There's some emphasis on it. Without the accent, it means that or who if it's referring to a person. And so lo que here, it doesn't have an accent, but annoyingly, it translates to what or that which. And we'll see some examples just so this becomes crystal clear for you guys. Ejemplo. Lo que necesita es un abrazo. Lo que, what. What he or she needs. I put he here. What he needs is a hug. Lo que necesita es un abrazo. So lo que is what or that which. That which he needs is a hug. You know, it sounds a bit formal and not so colloquial. So what is a Good translation here. I hate this emoji. I don't know why uh, I use that one, but it's it does show a hug. Otro ejemplo, another example. Lo que quiero decir es, what I mean is, this is a super common phrase in Spanish. Very good one to note down. So is that what you meant? No. Lo que quiero decir es, no, no, no. What I mean is, or that which I mean is, lo que quiero decir. Now, when do you use lo que? As I always say, it will come naturally over time. So just keep practicing and your, your ear will tune to it and you'll understand when to use it without putting too much thought. But a useful trick that I found is in English, if you're translating from English first, if you can introduce the thing that instead of the what, then you can use lo que. So we'll take our example again. What I mean is, that's the English. I want to say that in Spanish. If I take out the what and replace it with the thing that, the thing that I mean is, and if it makes sense, if it if it feels okay, then you can use lo que, lo que quiero decir es. Conversely, if it doesn't really sound right, then you're not going to use it. For example, I don't know what to say. In English, I don't know the thing that to say. I don't know the thing that to say. Ah, doesn't really doesn't really make sense. So. You're going to use just que here. No sé qué decir. No sé lo que decir. It doesn't, you know, the more you get comfortable with Spanish, you'll, you'll pick it up naturally. So try not to overthink it. I promise you it will, it will come. And you want to go and make mistakes. You want to be embarrassed. That's what it's all about. I promise you. I promise you that's what you're really looking for. It's the best. It's the best feeling. And that's that, chicos. So please do subscribe to the video. At the beginning, we saw K with an accent, K without an accent. And I have got a useful video on accents in Spanish below. So do check that out. I'm going to link it. And as I said before, do subscribe to the channel. Like this video. Give it a comment. It means the world to me. Muchas gracias. Hasta luego, chicos. Ciao.